Come on, kitty. Meow. Meow. Come on. Meow. Come on, Cleo. Make the right decision. It's either she's going to jump now or she's going to come to me. I got a call from Mira about her cat being stuck in a tree. Immediately, I could hear this cat was giving distress calls. How are you? Stressed? Yeah. I hear you, kitty. Cleo had been in this tree for two days, but they didn't even know where Cleo was in the tree. The tree was that dense. She's all the way out on this limb directly above us. Do you see her body right here? I ended up spotting Cleo and she was in the most precarious place on this tree. I started going up this tree and everything I touched just seems to snap right off. Cleo's crying at me. It's okay, I'm coming to help you, kitty cat. The limb that she was on was so weak. Kitty, I'm right here for you. I knew she wouldn't come to me with that branch there. She wouldn't abandon that secure feeling. Hey, kitty. Hey, kitty. Come on. So I managed to easily break this little branch off. So now she's exposed. Come to me now. Now you don't have any other option but to come to me. Come the on. limb was so unsturdy. Come on, kitty cat. It was pretty harrowing being that far out on this limb that it could break and that Cleo could jump. You only have to come six inches, baby. But she was just too scared to come to me. Eventually, I just decided to go for it. Cat's in the bag. But to get Cleo in the bag was an awesome feeling. We came down very slowly together, got to the ground, and I handed her to her family. We got the cat inside. Hey, Cleo. Cleo. They were so thankful and appreciative. I'm gonna come, little guy. Meow. I've rescued hundreds upon hundreds of cats from trees. I have a love for climbing trees and I love animals, so why not use my skills for some good? Hey, kitty. The way that rescuing a cat normally works is I'll get a phone call. Usually it's, oh my God, my cat's in the tree. I'll ask them to send me photographs of the tree so that I can assess what gear I will need. I let the people know there's a real possibility that their cat might jump if they have some family members or friends, grab a big tarp and stretch it out. My goal is to not scare the cat out of the tree. Now I'll just climb slowly, methodically, try to talk to the cat. Hey, kitty. Oh, buddy. Look at you, kitty. And then I get up to the cat, and uh, negotiating with that cat is the hardest part. I always try to give them as much opportunity to come to me as I can. Oh. I'm gonna have to get you into a bag quick. I try to always put a cat in the bag. It's the safest for both me and the cat. Okay, she's in the bag. I'll descend with the cat. Then I come down and we high five and- Here you are. Here you go. I go about my way. It's okay. To be able to help people and their animals enriches my life. You're in a big tree. I'm gonna come up there for you. There are a bunch of us that do this, and the main thing is to let people know who to call, and that is an arborist or get on catinatreerescue.com.